Yo guys, what's up? Unidentified Fool here, and today I'm bringing you a tutorial on how to get Total Media Extreme for free. Um, we'll start off where what you need to do first is click on the WinRAR link that I've left below, and you'll get this screen here. And what you need to do is you need to have a click on the 32 bit or the 64 bit, depending on what system you're running on. Mine's running on 32 bit, so I click there and I'm daft already, what I've done already is I've installed them already so that you know I mean it's a lot quicker and I'm not holding up a lot of video time. So what you do is you click on the thing there. If you if you have used control, install it. Um okay and basically what this program's gonna do is it's just unzips programs for you, a bit like WinZip. I'll just exit that now. And then what you need to do is go on to the media fire uh, link that I'll leave and this has got the total media extreme you don't need a patch or anything like that there's no serial codes needed then um, you just click the download bar is usually green there and what you do is you click there and it'll come down here click on your total media and it'll come up pop up in WinRAR and if it doesn't pop up in WinRAR um, open it up with WinRAR so that it can extract it just click on that installation files and look for your app setup exe application so that's there and this is your bar process, it's just extracting it all now. Um, you know what I mean? I'm not a big computer whiz kid. So, you know what I mean? If I'm saying things wrong, don't troll me because I'm not brilliant. It's just, you know what I mean? I didn't get the installation discs with my HDPV and I had a problem finding a good video. So, in a way, I'm kind of trying to upload a video for people so that, you know, if they're having the same problem, then maybe this video might help them. Select English or whatever language that you are. Follow the instructions that you get given. Um, yes, 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 yes. Sorry about the slow and boring bit. Um, you know I mean, when I got my HDPV, I did get the installation disc because I bought my HDPV as second hand, and I wasn't going to pay for it off the Harlech uh, website. Looked on YouTube, and there were several different videos. Some were good, and some were bad. And you know, what I mean, now that I'm up and running with HTTPV, I thought maybe it's a good idea to help people that may be having the same problem that I was. Um, you know, what I mean, I'll just close WinRAR now. Uh, you don't need WinRAR. Um, where's that installation gone? There, it's 55 percent. What it will do basically is it's installing it into your desktop, as you can see there. Everyone like my little background Batman logo. I have my screen going on here. Finally got my laptop working, so it's clear. Last time on my laptop, all this was full of icons. I don't know, I know really I should clean it all up and not have so much crap. But it'll get filled up again. You end up downloading more programs when you're doing montages and downloading more add-ons for Sony Vegas and all sorts. I'm using Sony Vegas 10 at the moment. Um, I need to get Sony Vegas 11. I can't really be bothered to crack Sony Vegas 11 and 10 is good enough for now. Um, just coming to the end of the installation. Yeah, my laptop's not brilliant. Click on finish. Then click on Total Media Extreme and it should come up with an update. You know what I mean? I have had on this program on before. I did remove it. Record video. There we go. Send. It's got an update. Just let me exit this. Sorry about that. Oh, piss off. Right. The update is there. Say so yes. Close Total Media Extreme so it can do it. And what I'll do is I'll just turn my PlayStation on. Just in. Ah, oh, they don't matter. I'm not going to turn my PlayStation on. It's downloading now. Um, and what it usually says after this is it usually says that you need to download the driver. And when I did install the driver, I've just removed all the programs so that I can do this tutorial and I can show you all the way through. So hopefully, people can follow what I'm doing and not have a problem following the steps that I'm doing rather than having the program installed and going, this is what you do but I'm not going to install it so I thought if I uh, remove everything and install it again it would be easier for people to maybe follow um, you know, I mean WinRAR is quite a useful program it's just like WinZip really um, it's useful to have on your computer um, there we go Make sure it's closed. So if you had it open, make sure that you closed Total Media Extreme before I said yeah. Administrator thing, agree to everything. 
Just going to install all its bits and bobs. Auto detect. I have my HDPVR already plugged in. It's turned on. PlayStation 3 ain't connected, turned on though, so I might have to turn PlayStation on. I'll let you know on that one. Sorry about the slow uploading, guys. And um, what I'll do is I'll leave a link. Uh, check out my Scream Dubstep remix that's up. My friend Rambi made it. Great remix. It's hit 2,980 views, which is awesome. Thank you very much. He's great. Little thing. I'll, he, if you click on the video, his Facebook's underneath. Go check him out. He does some great music, guys. Definitely worth checking out. I've also, because I've got my laptop back and it's fixed, I'm starting to upload videos. I've just loaded, uploaded hit markers. What the fuck? Um, check it out. I'm not going to restart my computer now because obviously my commentary will finish. Finish on that, and then you've got Total Media Extreme. Um, it's a bog standard one. I don't think the editing's there. So, but you can convert um, stuff. You can watch films, but you you know what I mean. You can use Windows and everything else. And that is basically how to download Total Media Extreme for free. I hope this video is good. You know what I mean. It's my first tutorial. I wasn't really aiming on bringing tutorials, but you know what I mean. I had HD PVR, and I had the same problem. So I wanted to help you guys out. Hopefully, this video is helpful. Drop a comment below if it's in, and I'll try and help you to the best of my ability. Um, give me some feedback guys on what you think of this tutorial, if it was good, if it was bad, if I mumbled on, if I didn't really say much, if anything that could help you. And I hope this video is helpful to everyone, so please like the video, please subscribe, check out my other videos. Cheers.